morning vlog. We're in the car right now. You, oh, you open up my vlog? You want to open it? <laughs> yes. Welcome back. I'm with David. Marcus in the back. I'm over here. And guess where we are right now? We're in Austin, as we said. We didn't say that. We're yet. picking up Santi. No traffic. Look at the time. It's pretty early. We left like right before 5:50. If not, we left at 5:50. We left at 4:49. No, we not. 4.49. Or 5.49. We look yeah. pretty fucking early and there's no traffic, which is the best time to get to Austin. The skyline's getting bigger. Well, we're crossing the river right now. Oh, bumps. Austin in the morning. <laughs> He's running. Welcome back. Well, the first thing that we're doing here in Austin Everyone's got their running shoes on, ready to hit Zoker Park. You can kind of see it this time. I'm kidding, you can see it. Hi, getting my running shoes on. So we're walking right now as my watch is getting ready for the GPS. Mark's freezing. It's what? How cold 55. is it? 55. 55 degree. It's free. Not today. I am not too sure. Are they? I, saw that I don't think you're supposed to. Well, it's okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, of course. She didn't know whether to pay to park or if people are crazy paying. I guess we're going to take a look. Pretty sure it says Sunday. Weekends, holidays, and special events. Pay to park fees are on weekends, holidays. Oh, you have to I'm only pay. Anyways. Recap, we pay for parking, only five bucks, rather than a $35 fee. That's a good recap. And yeah, you know, I I feel like I've learned through these lessons in the past where it's like I should have done it. Well, I did it this time so that I don't pay the hefty fee afterwards by the warden herself. Yeah, this is nice. This is the type of running that we need to be doing. See, Anthony, that's what you're missing out on, bud. Look at that. Dude, it's gonna be a nice picture on the bridge. Shante running the vapor flies. I know. He could be flying. We are going this way. Stop going the wrong way. Whew. You never told me the course beforehand. Look at it. Whoa. Whoa. Oh. See, I'm like recording and running. Go left. Go left. To the left. Look at this. You don't get this mile. You don't get this very often on the vlog. See, this is why running so nice. You gotta do stuff like this rather than sleeping in. You get cool views. Let's go right. You do this walking. How long would it take you walking? Less time than you run. Yeah, well, this is why I like running. You don't get to see this often. Run, 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 run. Definitely getting close to the Look at this. Like a winding loop. Well, because I have sweaty fingers, my phone got locked for five minutes. So you didn't get to see the cool skyscrapers that are behind me. Don't worry. I'll make sure we'll get on the way back. Look at this view. This would be a cool thumbnail. Running through the city with my woes. <laughs> the police don't want us running on the road. They don't want us waiting first place. That's exactly what we're doing. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Come on. We're in first place. Gotta keep it up, Mark. Keep it up. They're playing music back there. Gonna be ZZ Top, baby. All right, look where we made it to. We made it to the capital. Go in, go in. Go this way. We're going straight. We're going straight to the doorsteps. Let them know that. The boys are back in town. And that's law. It is law. You know, I didn't wake up this morning thinking, wow, I'm gonna run six miles and run by the Capitol. But here we are. Here we are doing it. Because other people aren't doing it. So we're gonna do we're doing it for them. No, keep going straight. Yeah, can we still haven't even hit we haven't hit three miles. I would say let's let's hit three. Let's hit three miles. We're almost making it to Santi's school. 
This is his last hurrah through Austin. <laughs> what? Maybe you'll run with Brett. If Brett runs anymore. Look at that view in back. This is the guy in first place for the race. Woo! Keep it up! See, I'm not part of this race anymore. I'm in my own head, my own race. Racing against me, the hardest race of your life. Dang, 953, fourth mile, what the hell, man? Anyways, as soon as I, as soon as I just stopped filming, some ladies already scream, hey, you're going the wrong way. <laughs> yeah, we know. We got the shortcut, we'll see you at the finish line. Shoot, we, we might be going towards the finish line. We're gonna be running a little fast. Uh-oh. <laughs> Slow down to a two hour pace. Yeah. <laughs> Dang, y'all didn't look that sweaty. Well, unfortunately, you were just <laughs> racing wrong. That has delivered all these cool skyscrapers, even right behind me. Ooh. One day, one day we'll live at the penthouse on top of this one. If we make a billion dollars. You're actually the owner of Amazon now. You ran across Jeff Bezos and he was like, David, would you like to own the company for- I made him an offer he can't refuse. What was the offer? Putt pulling? Uh, I can't disclose that. <laughs> damn it. Ah, oh, damn it. We're wrapping up, everyone's Jumping up, jumping up. So, six miles in the books for today. <sighs> Pretty good run. I feel quite nice. We did, I don't think that's gonna capture it. Six miles at 10.01 minute per mile pace. Pretty comfortable. We didn't bring our dogs for the weekly dog coffee and chat. Plan is now, Go to Barton Springs, jump in the cold water, get a nice cold plunge since that's like the new thing to do on social media is do a is cold. Is that a new thing to do? At least on YouTube that I've seen. People do it now. Like It's yeah. like in. It's like the thing to do. Wait, the polar plunges? I mean, I know. I'm saying yeah, people I'm have been doing that for a long time. As well. Yeah, but it's like, it's the new, it's a new thing online. Okay. Normal, the normal thing. So I guess we're going to be a part of that crowd now. All right, it looks like Santi found some new sunglasses. Yeah, Ray-Bans. Ray-Bans. Just laying around here. Oh, look at this. It's a needle. <laughs> <laughs> now we're just a bunch of adults walking through a playground. Stop and drive the car. Keep your hands oh, out wait. of Wait, some girl left her jacket. Maybe she was taken. Well, there's a water bottle, a free water bottle. Where? Right there on the playground. You want to drink it? It's a nice Where? sippy cup. The last time we were here, there was a shit ton of people. It took forever to get inside. And look at that, like no, no one's right here. How much? That was a, uh, that was really quick. Five bucks oh, took less than a minute. Like never worked more than like two hours. And we're in. Hello. Good, you? Well, we're here. Look how crowded it is. So crowded. This is called beating the crowd, people. Y'all gotta do it too. Just for reference, it's 8.48. What do you think Anthony's doing right now? He's probably sleeping. He's definitely asleep. He's probably, shh, shh. Or he might be out on 6th Street drunk somewhere and we haven't found his body. Yeah, Anthony actually slept on 6th Street last night. <laughs> Did you know that there's a serial killer apparently in Austin? Really? We have a flag. What, Elise face. tell you that? No, I no. told Santi. It's all over the news. It's all over the news, so maybe Anthony's body's in Rainy Street River. Oh, is he targeting people from New York or what? All right, there's Pablo. Well, it's real cold over there in the shade, I bet. We just gotta do it. Pablo's gonna do, well, Mark here is actually doing the honors, getting in the water first. Pablo will be the first one fully in the water, though. First official dive of the day. How is it, Pablo? <laughs> Man, it's cold. It? A little chilly? But it feels nice. How about you, Mark? How you doing? I think I might go in on the diving board. All right. <laughs> you sure you don't want to just swim across I to it? I gotta make up that jump. That jump sucks. My nipples right now are freaking diamond cutters. Sun's slowly starting coming out, as you can see. You can't even see Santi right by me. It's pretty cold. It's always cold, but 
nothing I can do about it. There goes Marcos. Little does he know, will he do a cannonball? Will he dive? What will he do? He's probably peeing his pants about how cold it is. All right, Mark. What was that? That was like the babyest jump. That's not that bad. Oh my gosh. He's like freaking freezing. Second person coming up on the diving board is David Robbins. Lame splash, lame jump. The boys are in. Mark, you look like you're freezing it's right there. It's kind of cold. It's because you're half out of the water. It's evaporating. Yeah. My balls are like shrinking back into my stomach right now. I said my balls are in my stomach right now. Yeah, mine are definitely a little tight. I see you go swim a couple You're the only swimmer here. They're tight. Why'd you say like that? Other side of the ducks. For the long. Could be better. I give that How is it, Pablo? Face first. Yeah. <laughs> that one felt better. Did it? It looked like you hit your face on the water. That's what it looked like to me. I give it a six. Boo. Santiago. There was a lot of splash. A uh, two. A two. <laughs> David. I I just want to know how that felt on your face. That's what I want to know. Oh, I didn't hit my face. It looked like you, it. You went face first. <laughs> the vlog begs to differ. Well, let's I review guess, the footage. I guess y'all will have to. Be the judge of it. And <laughs> Mark must be so mad because that little girl is like... This is like a Curb Your Enthusiasm moment. <laughs> it's like really windy. He's it's, it's wet. Cold. He's wet and standing. Standing waiting to go. Go. Alright. Another cannonball. So we're walking through the park. You see those people doing yoga behind me? I don't know if it's capturing them. They're behind me somewhere there. They're all men holding like freaking planks basically and they're going i am determined i am a man the, the part where they went i am a man that's the one that got me that was funny <laughs> i am empowered i am disciplined i like that i'm on the edge i'm on the edge was funny too they said i am on the edge yeah they did i did i'm on the edge of my tailbone mark and i are walking up the road Hi. what are we doing on the road here in austin now we're, we're still at the park you never so we're at another place downtown eating. It's called Bar and Coffee. I literally got Princess Parking. And I step out and I'm already here. Mm, got a mimosa. I got a chocolate chip pickle. Yeah. Pickle beef. Pickle time. Pickle meat. Oh, Ooh, food. those are good pickles too. Yeah. I kind of want to go with you something. Seem, you seem like a, a scone guy. I think I'm going to go with the blueberries. The white chocolate blueberry. Did you get me enough? There's a lot going on there. So, we've done it already in the vlog, but we're back at the thrift stores in Austin. This time with the boys. Marcos. Oh, it's size extra It's literally vintage. You can make it in. But you know who was probably 2002? Uh, when did Selena die? 95. Oh, dang it. You're off. <laughs> Man, there's like a whole strip of antiques or adventure stores. Hey, look at these. Like when you think of a vintage shirt. Yeah. Right? So. Classic. <laughs> I'm gonna find a shirt. I'm gonna find a shirt. Y'all are gonna have to get the prize. Just give me a second. Oh, they're all like Looking at the camera. Is there it's a prize one. if we get it right? No prize. Okay. The prize, the prize is that you're right. I think that one's gonna be $42. $42. $42. Santi? Santiago? $65. I was gonna say $62. Y'all don't know me. I don't really put it in my videos. One of my favorite places in Austin. It's not no store. It's not no grocery store. And I'll be quite disappointed if it's no longer in this area, but I'm pretty sure it's still here. Woo! 
sexy. It's not even open. We didn't last very long at the antique stores, vintage stores. We're at a brewing company. It's called Lazarus. They have hats. Pretty cool. Yeah, check it out. Whoa. Pretty nice. What'd you get? You got um, the buffalo jump. Buffalo jump, yeah. And Mark? Dark ale. Uh, I got the prodigal pills. I got a beer. <laughs> so we're in the Austin Public Library now because apparently it's really cool. So that's where we're headed. You know you're in Austin. <laughs> what comes to your mind when you hear the word jazz? Freedom. Freedom is the answer. No, I don't know if that's true. Mine is think of jazz hands. What did you write? What comes to your mind when you, you see the word jazz? Saxophone. Mine was both jazz hands. <laughs> this is honestly pretty cool. This is super cool. It's really like a Wonderland vibe. Wonder That's Wonder what it says, like Wonderland. Wonder it has a... David, you know what they say? It's the first time coming here. I'm not gonna say it, but it is the first time. So we got another first for the vlog, guys. We're yeah. at the Austin Public Library. <laughs> What do you think? What do y'all think? It's better than San Antonio Library. Every time. It's awesome. First time. See, we don't come to Austin very much. I think I've said it before, but this trip was a spontaneous one, say the less. And the fact that we get to have this sky view for free. I dry my stuff, my underwear is still wet from being out in Barton Springs. Shh, this is a library. Technically, I've gotten this on video before. Right. It's the second time on the vlog. Right there was whenever I went with Alexa, Katie, and Santi to go get baked beer. We ended up not going kayaking. Anthony and his friends didn't want to go, so we were just like, nah, we're not going to do it. So that's why we're killing time at a library. Although it's probably one of the coolest libraries I've been to. It's a cool library. Look at this. Look at this view that I'm I have right now. Whoa. Yeah, give it to Austin. But what do y'all think? Do these people have the coolest study spot? Or that guy over there? David, what are you supposed to do when you see a Buddha? What? When you see a Buddha, you're supposed to go. Uh, is that true? That is true. I don't know if that's true. Are you rub, his, rub his knees. And now. Ice cream time. Thank you. Do you have sunglasses? I do not. Your what? future's bright. Oh. That's a good one. Thank you. I, th I thought I was about to get in trouble for a <laughs> I think I got that audio. It's kind of funny though. <laughs> so we got here, and the only person that said, I want to do something light was David. What the fuck is he eating? I think it's about like two pounds. I didn't know it's gonna be this big when I ordered it. Yeah, that's for the biggest thing on the menu. My I guy. didn't think it was gonna be that big. That's yeah, pretty big. Mark got a baby size. It doesn't. Size size size. The menu does not say that this is the biggest thing on the menu. That just says. You can just tell. You can just look at it by price. That thing was like so freaking it wasn't big compared. That much to more expensive than everything else. That thing has brownie. The, the lady even said, I didn't even know you can name that much candy. You're the <laughs> only person I've ever seen. That's not what she said. <laughs> what she said was. The first person. <laughs> I was the first person identified. to identify the Butterfinger correctly. This is a retake on it. Marcos. We filled our dance card today, baby. <laughs> <laughs> we sure did fill it. Anyways, like, comment, subscribe. See you later.